yeah, I think big things are gonna happen this weekend. I'm like really, really excited that our house will finally start to really settle in and be, you know, everything is kind of where it's going to be. Good morning, guys. So I started my day with another really fun delivery that I am super psyched about. Uh, I ordered myself a table runner for Thanksgiving like a couple weeks ago and it just got here. And it's off Amazon and I feel like things like that, it's always kind of hit or miss with the quality, but like I am so excited. It's literally exactly like what I was hoping it would be. It looks like really, really nice quality and I think it's gonna be perfect for Thanksgiving. So this is what it looks like. Like I said, it's a table runner, so I'll run it down the center of my table over likely a white tablecloth. And it's like this really pretty like cut out pattern here. It's kind of folded over, so let me see, I would show you. There you go, so it's like a really pretty like cut out um, fall leaves and like some squash patterns and it's just like literally the cutest thing ever. I saw it on Amazon and needed it. Like <laughs> I think it's just so cute and so perfect and so exactly like how I would, you know, design a perfect table runner for my fall table. So I am really excited about that, especially since we are hosting Thanksgiving this year. So yeah, and I'm really excited that it came and it is very nice quality. Like it's not, it doesn't feel or look cheap. It, you know, looks exactly how I hoped it would look in person. Um, and so if you want this for yourself, I'll definitely leave the link for it in the description box because I absolutely love it. I think it's something, I, if I remember correctly, like five feet or a little over five feet long. So it's not like a dinky little thing either. It's pretty decently long and so it should fit across the whole table and I am so, so excited. All right, so I'm basically just kind of running around the house again, unpacking what I can and putting it, you know, putting things where they go. I was able to unpack another box from the kitchen. We are accumulating quite the amount of, you know, boxes kind of piled up around our apartment that are just empty. There's more over here. But I do want to save them in case I want to use them for like, um, like I was talking about the other day, storing our seasonal decor until we can get some, you know, nice sturdy plastic bins. But um, yeah, anyways, uh, I think I'm gonna take a bit of a break and set up my bullet journal because I never actually did that for November and I want to have it set up for November. So, um, but first I'm gonna run around the house and collect all the trash out of the trash cans because it's trash night tonight. So I want to make sure I get all of that done so that I like to, I used to do, um, trash like on the weekends, like, you know, every weekend I would just collect everything and then throw it at the dumpster because it could, I could do it whenever I wanted, um, because we live in an apartment with a dumpster right outside, but now that we have like trash days, I like to do like, so for example, we had recycling taken away this morning. Um, they come at like 4.30 in the morning for some reason, which is kind of weird, but um, so anyways, yesterday I like went around the house and made sure that everything that we, you know, wanted to get taken by the recycling truck was together so that we could put it, you know, out by the curb. And tomorrow the trash is gonna get taken, so I wanna make sure I go around all the, like, you know, the house today and empty all the trash cans and get everything outside for the dumpster to, or for the trash truck tomorrow so that it, you know, we can start another week with, you know, empty trash cans. I don't know why I'm talking about this, guys. Anyways, I'm gonna go empty my trash cans and then work on setting up my bullet journal. All right, so it is a bit later and Melissa got home from work. I wanted to really quickly show you guys how I set up my monthly calendars in my bullet journal. I do this like kind of pinwheel style. So the days of the month and like the days of the week that coordinates to the date go around in the circle. I will write the, um, month's name in the middle there and then as the month like happens or if like I make any plans for that month I'll kind of fill it in on the corresponding date and yeah I just kind of wanted to give you guys an idea if you are a fellow bullet journaler for the monthly organization thing this is not my idea I'm not this is not like an original idea I definitely got it from someone on Instagram cannot remember who at the moment but yeah <laughs> And so yeah, Melissa got home from work and she just put the two expedits and her office chair up in her office that I've been asking her to do. So our basement is finally like fully clear. So this weekend we should be able to move the TV and TV stand down there, which is like so exciting. So then we can have like a clear living room and everything can really start looking like a house. <laughs> what do you think about that? Yeah, I think I'm gonna ask for a sound bar for Christmas. Ooh, that's a good idea. Like surround sound system is gonna be like a couple thousand dollars. So yeah, that's, like that's gonna take a while. <laughs> but like, just we our basement out. is hooked up for surround sound, but yeah, we yeah. would need the speakers. But so I was thinking, like, the, I was looking at some like for like Black Friday deals, and they're like hundred twenty bucks. Oh, nice. Like you know what I mean? Just yeah. Like a small, like just something fun for when we're watching movies and stuff. Yeah. Especially down in the basement, like. Because we want to start having, we want to do Game of Thrones nights with the neighbors. Yeah, we were talking about that last night about having like, you know, Game of Thrones parties down. Because our basement would be like totally perfect Cute, for that. Yeah. yeah. And with the two couches, oh, yeah. we could add some bean bags. Like, how yes. perfect would that, that be? Would be perfect. Right? <sighs> I have to decide what I want for dinner. Yeah, I know. 
<laughs> what do you want for dinner, huh? Oh, me? I just want dog food. Same dog food I eat every night. That's what I want. Poor, poor Dakota. Poor Dakota. So this is what the basement's looking like. I'm so excited. It is like completely cleared out for the most part. This bookshelf is being stored down here for a minute, but it will eventually go up in the living room, I'm thinking. But yeah, we still need to clear out a couple of things in there for it to fit. But yeah, the basement is like pretty much completely cleared out. So this weekend we will definitely be able to bring the TV and TV stand down. We're gonna mount the TV obviously on that TV mount and then put the TV stand right under there and all of that stuff will, you know, kind of just get moved over there because we still can store some stuff down here like while we're, you know, looking for places to put it basically like all the stuff on the walls we haven't even begun the thought of to think about where we're hanging things on walls so all that stuff is pretty much staying down here until we find a place for it and like the kitchen stuff again will be able to slowly be unpacked as we finish painting the cabinets which hopefully again will be this weekend so yeah, I think big things are gonna happen this weekend. I'm like really, really excited that our house will finally start to really settle in and be, you know, everything is kind of where it's going to be, you know, and just, yeah, starting to come together. I'm really, really excited. All right, dinner is served. We are having the chicken fried rice that we picked up at Trader Joe's the other night, and it looks so, so good. Melissa's already tried it the other day. Did you like it? Yeah, it was really good. Yeah, actually. nice, I'm excited. Like frozen. Like pre-prepared meal? Yeah. Yeah, it looks really good. I'm definitely excited to try this. Dakota. Is it time to go to bed? Uh, you want to go to bed? She really does not like the camera. As soon as I turn on, she wants nothing to do with me. You were giving me kisses a second ago. Dakota. Dakota. She won't look at me. Hi. You ready to go to sleep? Yeah. You be my little snuggle bunny tonight. I'm so tired, you guys. Yeah. So ready for bed. <laughs> we watched um, a couple episodes of This Is Us. The fried rice was really good. It's like, I definitely wouldn't say it's up to par with like fresh made, like a you know, homemade fried rice, but like for being a frozen meal thing, mm -hmm. it was very good. So, highly recommend for a nice, easy to throw together meal for nights that you don't feel like cooking <laughs> and for nights that you don't feel like cooking but are also trying to avoid eating out for the millionth time in a row <laughs> and melissa actually has off work tomorrow and so we are lucky enough to have her around yep so that'll be nice we're going to get bagels in the morning yeah we've already made plans she's gonna go to the um coffee shop that our neighbors had recommended as their favorite local coffee shop remember i showed you guys that has like the cool teal doors as like their tables and yeah we really liked it so we're gonna go back tomorrow we are getting bagels and Melissa's gonna get me another giant donut because I couldn't resist and so yeah you're splitting it with me I'm splitting it with splitting you it see with this me. is the downside of when your wife starts to eat gluten again you start having to share your gluten not cool Fine, I'll get my own and then I'll be fat and then I'll complain about it and then you'll yell at me for complaining about being fat Ugh, you're not fat I know I'm not fat. I know. Oh, now that I just told, I, oh man, you guys are all going to yell at me in the comments now, aren't you? Yes, yell at her. See, that is the one thing I don't like about YouTube, is that <laughs> if you accidentally say something, yeah. then you get yelled at by the people that watch your videos. Mm -hmm. Like, Melissa, don't say that. Melissa, don't say that. I appreciate it, though. <laughs> we love wow, watch nobody say anything now. <laughs> I'm watching nobody say anything. And I've gone on for like two minutes now talking about, yeah. All right. Good night. Moral of the story, she's beautiful. <laughs> Thank you. But yeah, I am uh, exhausted. You know who's more beautiful, though? This one. This one right here. So beautiful. With her stinky breath. With her stinky, stinky breath. <laughs> but yeah, we are going to... Oh, are you going to take the trash for me? Oh, thank you, Dakota. It's trash night, so Dakota's going to take the trash cans out to the curb. Oh, it is. I forgot. <laughs> also, can you, um, I'm going to help you empty the fridge because we have some stuff things to be thrown away. So before you take the kitchen trash out. Let's go. Coming. <laughs> All right, guys, we got to go. So I hope you enjoyed the vlog and please give it a thumbs up if you liked it. And don't forget to subscribe down below to follow along with all of our daily vlogs. And we will see you guys tomorrow. Good night. Mm -hmm.